for vessel. Yeah, are, you just, are you set up? I'll just say, let's get this party started. Sure, why not? We'll go with that. I mean, since the tanks have to start on party already, time, right? So, party time. Right. Yeah, that is not real. There's no real, no real. So we rolling for initiative. Let's do it. No. Looks like you're going first. <laughs> you never know, but probably so. Let me pull up my handy dandy SAP. Just, just so I have it. I like Lowest wins. It. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we're gonna do this. Of course, they're going to tell me here, but these guys are going to assault mine. And they're going to actually. They might want to run. I think so. So I'm gonna pull them out one at a time just so I can get them out of here. I, I like to put mm. the machine guns on top, just yeah. they're carrying it, right? So Yeah. <laughs> Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, whoops, seven, eight. And they picked up the mines in G sixty. Okay. And right. then let me mark them winded. You can go. Okay, I'm gonna go. Yeah, okay, I guess I shouldn't. Control R run. Oh, okay. it is. So I'm gonna double check. I wonder if I have to be a sultan to do that. You, you go, but I can always win. No, you, you, you don't. Okay. You don't. You don't. We, we we double checked in the game because yeah, I felt like it was one of those things we just you have to. But odd. You know. Anyway, <laughs> seems too too easy, right? Yeah, exactly. So one, two, oh, come on, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because they're with a the leader. Hmm. Hold on. Maybe that's maybe that's not where I actually want to go. <laughs> see where your guys are going to be at. Oh, no, no, that was fine. Yeah, that was fine. All right, I'm done. Go winded. Yep. Which is not good. W. All right, I'm going to have to assault move with this guy because he's moving hex side of those. One, two. Control I. Three. Four, five, six. Okay. That's you. Mega? Yep. With your one squad. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's okay. That should be a. Uh, yeah, this guy will also do some run. There you go. Yeah, that should be most of the interruptions. So. <laughs> Five. Nope. Oh, yeah. He's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get two more. Sorry, I looked at this and I don't remember what I was, what was the best thing to do. <laughs> Come at five. Oh, that's irritating. I wanted to be at six. Hurt. I 
was four, I guess. Okay, yeah, whatever. Yeah, there. Yeah, no, that's fine. Okay, done. Okay. <clears throat> hmm. And you can just move your last two guys, obviously, but... Yeah, so there. I think literally can do nothing. No off fire, no, no more movement. Hmm. Are you recording this one? Should I try and be entertaining? Yeah. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Uh, okay. Let's just see now. Yeah. That's interesting, I guess. I can't move after an offload, so I guess they'll just go here. Let me turn this tank. Which way is he facing this? Control. Uh, yep. Okay. So it's obviously six. And then the uh, infantry will go off here. Mm, writing. Let's see. Okay. So, and I think when they offload, they're considered to assault move. So I'm marking that as assault move. But that's it for. Can they jump move. off? Can they jump off on the same? Yeah. They just the vehicle just okay. can't move after they uh, offload. After that, okay. Right. Close assault. Sure. I'm sure, this isn't gonna be uh, too shocking. Yeah. We'll go here. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Yeah. Mm, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually. You know, no. I should have done something different with that big stack, but that's okay. Yeah, it's all right. That's why we play, because then we just play it again. <laughs> yeah. At some point. Right? Uh, and then these guys. Well, part. Of... Go ahead. Yeah, part of the cool thing about this one is it's small enough and. It's intricate, but there's like kind of a limited number of things you can do, so it makes right. it kind of a chess like. And then you look through, you can play like openings. You know, right. like okay, I'm going to play this opening or that opening, and exactly. variations. And there's a lot of micro tactical decisions, right? So, right, which is good. Okay, so we both close assaulted. End of turn. These tanks will both stay in motion. This continuous movement. Continue okay. movement. Hey, look at that. Turn two. We just don't have a Just in case I get that Panzer Shrek. That's right. All right. Fire movement. Tide now. Here we go. All right. This tank is going to assault me. He's going to go one and a half, two, three and a half, four and a half, five. No, it's not, it's not half because it's on a, a road with a building. Six. Just one. No, right. but the ones without buildings are half. Only the hexide roads are half. Uh, I mean one. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even notice. I just counted them all in one. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, you have to use a salt move to use a hexane road, but... Right, yeah. yeah. But the ones that are, yeah, not on not only buildings are on right. hexane roads, they're just one. I just wasn't paying attention, just assumed they were all building, building hexes, but they're, but they're not. Not nope. at all. And then I'm going to... Where is the... Where's the turret on this thing? Like, oh, there it is. Control, rotate, turret. Oh, geez. Uh, do I have to turn it on? There it is. Okay. So I rotate my turret while I'm moving. So, and we will fire at that building. Do you have, uh, sorry, yep. for my ignorance about vehicle rules yep. you, you can you rotate turret 
freely as you're moving? Well, yeah. So every hex you can rotate one vertex. So I just waited to the end to rotate it all because I knew where. So I should have done it as I was moving. Sorry. No, no, that's fine. I don't care. I just make. I yeah. don't remember a lot of the the, the details for vehicles. Okay. Yep. Sweet. So I'm going to fire the machine guns first. So I will be halved. So it'll be four plus three. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be a big fat nothing. Uh, and then I, oh, I might as well mark CMG and BMG, right? And then I'm going to go ahead and fire the main arm of that. Uh, I'm going to be a nine, five for moving. I will shoot at the building. So I think that's going to be it. So it's a four to hit. Boom. Got it. So it is a there are seventy fives, right? Yep. So it's a fourteen halved to seven is on the six plus three because I didn't because I shot the building. So it's on the six plus three. That is a C one. And then I'm going to be at a six, five, at a four because of the tank. Yep. Dope. Here we go. Okay. Assault move one, two, three, four. <laughs> that winded comes off. Yep. Unfortunately, I could not see any of that. You're up. All right. Hmm. Hmm. I think these guys will. Oh, I want to do. Hmm. I think hmm. I didn't expect you to do that. Now I'm now I'm stumped. Alright, so those guys go there. One, two, three. Ugh. Interesting. So I guess these guys will ah, assault move. Uh, no, I'm gonna crawl. They're just gonna crawl here and stop. Obviously. Oh, you're done. I'm dead. It's all you, yeah. unless I can, unless you move into my line of sight. Right, right, right. <laughs> so this tank will assault move, and he'll go one, two. Three. I need to grab a... <sighs> you know there's a hexide road marker somewhere. There it is. Oops. And he's not going to have a target, so he'll stop there. These guys, I guess they will. Huh. <coughs> I'm 
two, three, four, five, six. Are they winded? Oops, uh, somehow they all got marked winded. These guys are not winded. Captain Dorman. You bet. Good old Drew Dorman. Coming for me. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. It's done. Boom. Close assault. Ooh, I think it's going to be you. Is. Make your choice. Yeah, it's not a. It's not a great choice. <laughs> I mean, I. It, for victory points, I want to move into one of the more advanced buildings that can right. get victory points. But I, I have three squads, and one of them, if I leave one of them to be, bro to be broken, mm -hmm. that's probably not going to go, go well. Well, I mean, I just say you'd move the leader that way, but and leave the squads to take the building. But that's, you know, whatever. Yeah, but, yeah I don't do that. Okay. No, there's, Tony, there's no collateral fire because uh, that came off at the end of the fire, fire right. movement. Team. Right. We just never marked it because it wasn't important. <laughs> well, I mean, there's so few counters, you're very yeah. rarely going to be walking through collateral fire. Yeah. 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 Hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. No, right. no guarantees. End of turn. Uh, I think I'm going to stay moving, actually. I don't see a need to stop yet. Well, it's 11 o'clock here, guys. I'm going to let you go, and right, um, I'll, I'll let you guys know how things go and okay. um, how things are working. Talk cool. to you guys later, man. See ya. Mm -hmm. Great. See you. Dude. Bye. Uh, do I want to stay? Yeah, I guess I stay in motion. All right, so you got to roll rally. Okay. But both of your tanks are staying moving? Yep. Okay. Uh, so what do we, what do we got here? Well, plus I'm probably going to need the score. Uh, yeah. uh, so that's going to be a plus... Three plus three for my shit, and then minus one for the FE. So plus two is it a six or eight or better? Okay. All right. All right. Turn three. No indirect fire. Fire movement. Ugh. Jeez. Go first. Hello. It's so tempting to shoot at that tank, but mm -hmm. with the plus two for continued move, continued movement, it just uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. Do you take your lumps? You know what I mean. <laughs> a lot of lumps. Yeah. yeah. Well, I here's mean, the it's thing. It's only C two. It's spread out between a bunch of guys. It's not right. Uh, not What's the, the morale checks? But yeah. But here's the thing: if you wreck the tank, yeah. you win. You know, so, that's what that's why that's yeah, right. It was a gamble it, on my part. It, it, that's why I'm considering it, right? That's what I'm considering it because I'm if I don't, uh, you know, I'm, I'm losing horribly right now, like, <laughs> you know, it's not looking good. <laughs> this is the kind of moment to take that sort of risk. What is it at one range and a seven? Yeah, so it'd be a five or better, 50% chance. Uh, that's not bad. yeah, because I'm no 60% because I'm the leader. Oh, uh, leader. and and I'm a large target. Sherman, oh, Sherman's yeah, a big shoot. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's a, that's a seven or better, right? Because it's minus or plus two for your for so the, then minus one for the large and then can one I... for minus one for the leader. and personnel. So I'm wondering because my Oh, that's a that's a well. He's got Willie Pete. So I'm thinking I could fire smoke as an onboard gun. That oh, seems... but I won. I won an issue. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm sorry. In the indirect fire phase. Oh, <laughs> now you're getting nervous. <laughs> well, no. I'm just. I'm wondering. Would that have been a smart thing to do? I and I don't think so. You know what I mean? But I could have. I guess. Right. Yeah, yeah. But but see they're red, we're, so I mean definitely very rarely are they gonna have chance. smoke, right? So and 
created. What, is, what on Red is two or two or three? Uh, one or two. Otherwise, it just becomes oh, okay. a uh, a uh, regular round, right? A regular shot. Well, yeah. yeah except in this case, it doesn't matter. So. Okay. Yeah. Right. Knock it out. And what's oh, and is green? It's green is seven or green is uh, one to five, one to six, one to five. It's actually on the chart somewhere. There it is. Uh, one to five. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's not that great. I thought it was better than that for some reason. Yeah. All right. Well, fuck it. Let's do it then. Right. Could be a really short scenario. It could. I mean, it is a short scenario, but it could be extra, extra short. Right. All right. So seven or better is a hit. <laughs> right. And yeah, you're six. rolling. You're rolling. Oh, actually, you do. You need to roll location I'll, because you hit it in the track. Yeah. <laughs> God, right. Although it's a it's a it's a large target, so you'll be minus one. You cannot hit the track, which is interesting. Okay. Sherman's never take track hits. That's kind of odd, huh? Seems wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So you're That's going to be rolling on the five plus, no matter what, because the Panzer Shrek is a seventeen penetration. Yeah. 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 So three That's, is a burn. That's the. Oh, that was location. Oh, I'm sorry. 10, right? Yeah. Well, you can't. Yeah. Even then, even no, so, okay. it's minus one. Well, yeah. So you hit the turret. Okay. And I don't think. But, oh, but that's front okay. turret. So actually, that might not be too bad. Right. I think I think it might be. Well, I don't have the I have the FE card out, but I don't know where it went. Oh, uh, man. It might be like an 11. It's still an 11, so you're still on the 5+. Plus. Plus. Yeah, no matter what, it's a 5+. It's a plus. So go ahead. Don't roll a 10. All right, here we go. Don't roll a 10. No! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Total whiff. Yeah. It was a dud round. 10%? Yeah. Round. All right, C2. Let's oh, my it. God. That is crazy. It's a C2 and a morale check, right? I think it's uh, you mean just a, the morale check for the C two, right? Yeah, well, from yeah, that's what I meant. It's a C two and then a morale check for everybody. In the... oh. I keep using Control X. Don't don't do that. Control T is what. Yeah, emergency use in the event the other player wishes to fight. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Yep, casual. I mean, it could have just been a. Uh, Wow. It could have been an M. It would have could have not been the game though, because it could have been an M on a, a possible K kill and an M kill or an F kill. Uh, but then there's the bailout chance, which would still get. Well, it. yeah, I guess so. It's only if you. Re well. Yeah. Because you get victory too. Yeah. But. Yeah. It would have been close. I don't know what. It would have been. Yeah. It would have been well, but even on a possible. Possible K kill. For an AFV, it just becomes a K turret kill. on the front. Right. Oh right, yeah, exactly. If you don't have kill it. Oh, but if you do have killed, then it's not. Yeah. But Roll for M kill. It's not a kill. So an F kill is. Yeah. 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 So I guess that's that's actually how you hit a turret. I guess on a Sherman, is you get a, uh, right. a possible K kill. Right. Yeah. All right. Uh, so let me make these morale checks. So it's going to be minus. Three minus two for the C two minus one for the tank, and it's going to be so for the leader plus two for the two squads. So uh, be, uh, only plus one because the one squad is reduced. Five. Yeah. No, right. there's two, but there's two squads. There. But the reduced squad. All three of my squads. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I see the other one. Sorry. For some reason, when I first mouse they're over, all, they're was, all hanging out. Yeah, he was hidden. That's weird. He was That's hiding. That's yeah, Maple was hiding him. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's like to hide my OCS airfield. Yes. Um, <laughs> all right, so five are better for the leader. Yeah, that's, that's fortunate. And then we'll do the uh, the half squad. So he's going to be flat five. He makes wow. it. Wow. Let's do the oh. The MG42 squad, so he's going to be minus one, so he'll be a seven. He makes it, and then the other guy will also be a seven if he makes it. All right, so I compensated for my 
sort of compensated for my horrible, horrible right. rolling of a 10 with a bunch of good morale. Crazy. All right. Yeah. Did you want to, well, do you want to fire your squad at all? Since you marked him as fire? Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, so how does that, so how does that work? That's actually something I've, my, yeah, so my only that's why you lose tools. the one so when, firepower, right? Because that one dude fired the LAT. So the rest of the squad can do something else. Okay, so okay, so you can fire a machine gun and not fire the squad, and then still fire the squad later. For example, I think if you fire the machine gun, you have to fire the squad at the same time. Like I don't think you can separate those two. You know what I mean? So yeah, if you but, fired the Panzer Strike, you need to fire weapons. the squad. Right. But oh, but it doesn't have to be at the same target. Right. Yeah, the other six quote mm. guys can do whatever you want. I mean you could try to suppress the tank with gunfire okay. or whatever. Right. right. Okay. And then the leader would still direct them as well. Correct. Which is, would be handy. As long as he's doing some kind of directing from the hex, he continues to do it. Okay. Okay. So you can't say you can't save you can't fire weapons separately and save the squad for later, but the squad I mean, can fire it. Do, don't do, think so. I mean, we could probably. Does. Yeah, I think we could dive into the rules, but I think if oh look, because really what you're doing, you're not activating the weapon; you're activating the squad to fire, and right. as part of that, the weapon is firing, right? Right. But some guys carry it, not the whole. Correct. The squad. Right. Okay. Jeez, should I shoot at the tank? What? Uh, no, I'm gonna shoot at your big old, your big old stack. Okay. So that's gonna be a six. Yep. Um, okay. Now here's another question. Mm -hmm. If I want, I'm not going to, but I, I assume I could, could not. I would not be able to. Yeah, I couldn't do a fire group now because you, be, you could have if you declare it right at the. At, you know, hey, I'm gonna fire everybody, and then the Panzer Strike shoots here, and uh, else shoots here, right? Really? Okay. Sure. For some reason, I would assume that weapons had to take their own, like their own impulse, and wouldn't mm -hmm. be able to. Okay. So uh, the only exception is like mortars can't be part of a fire group, right? So they have to fire something. No, right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. So we'll shoot at your uh, Cap Captain Dorman and his, okay. his buddy. So six. Yep. Uh, plus two, I think. So yep. minus one for the leader, plus three for the building. Yep. Nope. Nothing. All right. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think this tank is going to assault move, and he does not like being there. <laughs> um, so I guess where does he want to go? Because I think... What's in that hex? Yeah, there's building in that hex. That's why I don't want to do that. Could go. Oh, one. <laughs> so he's going to go half. One. Two. Three, four. Five. Six. And we'll rotate the turret. Oh, which way is that? That is clockwise. <laughs> oh, that way. Oh, that did the whole thing. Where is it supposed to? Where, where's the front? The front is where the move symbol is. But for some reason, that okay. rotated. Oh, I think I hit the wrong rotate. Rotate turret clockwise. There we go. All right. So still in the arc. Oh yeah, I was joking. I was joking, but then I realized actually a lot of times I look at look at the AMV right. art. I'm like, oh yeah, I don't you, know where the front of this tank is. Right. Sometimes it's hard to tell. Um, we'll fire machine guns again downhill into the building. Halved up three. Oh, right. Okay. So four with plus three. That's gonna be nothing. Well, but you can just fire the. Uh, well, not that it matters. But you can just only fire the the coax, right? Because the bow is pointed. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. 
you are absolutely right. Um, in fact, I don't think I could fire my bow last time. That's duh. Um, so it would have been on the two. Uh, we'll fire the MA again at the building. Uh, only okay. now I am at, what is he, a C weapon at th uh, three hex range. So on a seven moving, I need a two to hit. Let me, mm -hmm. let me mark him as fired MA. Okay. Uh, I'm done. And that was stupid. I should have fired the infantry. That's you. Oh, all right, all right. So I'm doing stuff. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> what? Yeah, so I'll fire the squad and the machine gun at, at your stack in L14. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be on the 10 column, 10 plus 3. Looks like nothing. We got seven on the seven on the ten column. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So fire. to fire. Uh, yeah, I'm, I think I'm just gonna fire them both. Okay. Not too worried about you running up on me right now. So. Uh, yeah. So now it's gonna be on the four, four plus three. So I need a one. And again. <laughs> nope. All right, here go. Hmm. Uh, the problem is where you're sitting just is not real conducive. My tank's amphibious because that would be very helpful at this point. Fantastic. <laughs> Maybe one half, two. I guess I could send him around there too. Two. I think he's. Mm, no, I'll use my. Uh, we'll fire. Whatever. Okay. Hey, let's get used to using these, right? Boom. Boom. So we're going to fire there. There's so, there's so little stuff. It's like, it's yeah, I know. One, it's like okay. one stack of infantry. <laughs> Um, I just like seeing those out there. They're funny. All right. I've okay. got what? Five, 10, 16, 18. So I'll be on the 14, uh, up one, three for the building, uh, two for the leader. And then plus plus one more for a win because you've got two guys in there who are winded. Are they still winded? Are they should are they still winded? Or is that did they, uh, they, take off? they still winded? No, you're right because they ran in their last turn, so they're still winded until the end of this turn, okay. or until they do, do something. But right. in this case, right? Yeah, I mean, I could it makes a different like. Yeah, do I leave if them assault, out? Like if you assault move and then opera. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But if I leave them out, I'll drop too far. I'll just, I'll leave them in. That's fine. Oh, okay. So it's on the 14 plus, plus two, four. right? Two. Okay. Four and then two four higher. So, yeah. Like that? Yeah, that's, that's perfect. All right. So we will fire okay. right with the machine gun. So I'll be on the four, and I will not fire rate on the bar gunner. So it'll be four plus one. Also nothing. So that's it for those guys. And then you can, boom, shoot. Hmm. <laughs> well, that was my plan, so <laughs> let's, let's fall. 
going to carry them out the plan. All right, so this guy's going to assault move mm -hmm. here. I'm not sure if you can hire with a Gets traced from the middle of the road. Uh, gets traced from, yeah, the middle of the art. Right? Yeah. No, it clicks, clips the... That wasn't quite in the middle. Building. But, okay. yeah, I'm pretty sure it clips the building. There. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm, I think I'm done. I think that's all my dudes. Oop. Put it back there. Alrighty. Oh. Oh, did you want to move into that building too? Did you? Sorry. Want... I, I th did. Yeah, I, I thought you were stopping. Okay. No, I mean this was the, this That's was fine. the plan. So we're that was go. that was the plan all along. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I mean the plan was to end up in end up in with a main stack in like K15 or, or L, right. L14. Right. And then have these guys run around in the back. Clean what happens buildings. is if you just... Right. Yeah. Because if you, if you start working your way from the back to the front, and then mm -hmm. you just have to work back, and then they just follow you and take the building. So right. It doesn't, it doesn't really work. Uh, yeah. But it didn't work out because... Right. I did not realize how quick, how far the tanks could advance because of the half movement <laughs> points. Because not all those are building roads, so right. that makes a big difference. So I have to rethink my German huh. strategy. Glad I, glad I played the Americans. <laughs> right. So it's yeah. gonna be one, two, that'd be three, four, five. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Half. We will rotate our turret. One. And half. Two. Three. Four. Is that right? That's two, three, that's four, that's four and a half. Actually, I don't want to rotate the turret because. Ah, son of a bitch. Uh, because I'm going to go. Nope. Yep. Five and a half. All right. We will fire the coax. So on the two plus three, I need a one. Nope. We'll fire the main armament at the building. Um, that's a nine, a five, I need a four. That's a hit. So we're on the six plus three. Uh, no. <laughs> okay that's it fire movement is over close assault so, I think you're going first oh hooray <laughs> <laughs> sorry we're just going to take a, a minute here to think about <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna extricate myself from this. This bundle. Um, you must be paratroopers because you're surrounded. <laughs> yeah. False Magers. but these guys are the false Magers that you know. <laughs> Goring just said were false Magers. But... right? Exactly. But they weren't <laughs> really false Magers. They weren't really false Magers. Right. Never jumped out of an airplane and alive. <laughs> but we got the blue uniforms out. That's right. That's what matters. That's what a lot, a long game. Mm -hmm. Um. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, the plan I'm coming up with leads to not losing all my guys, but doesn't doesn't lead to any actual winning. <laughs> doesn't sound like a great plan, right? I mean, the, my conclusion for this scenario is well, apart from the plan that I had, obviously it didn't work, <laughs> uh, is that the Germans have to kill, have to eliminate something. Correct. To yeah. Have a have a good shot at winning. Yep, I agree. Yeah. Or have a completely inept American surprise. But... <laughs> either, either way. That was a, that was a very effective. Very right. effective. Uh, yeah, well, I guess we'll follow up, right? Yeah, I think so. And then you just have your... Oh, he's stacking back up. He's going for the kill. Yeah. Okay. Gotta, Close assault is over. End of turn. Huh. See, those guys are on the hill now. They could probably stop. But I think they will continue to be in motion because we like being in motion. Well, those guys are, can't see anything now, so we don't much chance to stop those guys. Maybe. Let me. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to see anyway, so. Nope, I have to stay in motion. I didn't think so. Cut the building. So no broken, no nothing. No motion. Come down here too. Okay. All right. No indirect fire. Fire. Ah. Ha. Hi. Wow. Roll seven. What are the odds? Roll seven. Nope. Roll seven. Nope. Nope. What? One and one thousand. Well, I mean, assuming you're going to say, what are the odds that any number is rolled three times? Right. Or one and one hundred, right? Yeah. Well, no. What are the odds of me rolling another seven? Oh, all right. One in ten. <laughs> this time we're going to fire on your guys, obviously. Um, no winded. So I think I was on the fourteen last time. We'll go with that. Uh, 14 up to no, up one. Up one, because no, no, no winded guy now. Right. Ooh, oh, C3. Yeah. yeah, it's gonna be a problem. All right, well, I'm just gonna eliminate this squad. You can go into purgatory off the map. Mm -hmm. Uh, OMG squad take a casualty. So okay, but there's no one around, which is nice. So the leader is going to be minus one. So five. No, he's minus three. <laughs> Don't lie. This was no, minus three, but then plus two for the two. Oh for, yeah, right. duh. Right. you were doing the net, so yeah, 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 yeah. I was trying to save the yep. <laughs> save the calculator. Nope. Got it. Yeah. Uh, I should do somebody next. <laughs> yeah, I should do the the guy with the, the Panzer Trek first because he's okay. going to be in eight and then net minus one, so seven. Uh -oh. Courage. No. Almost. <laughs> Almost. 10% chance. Almost, but so close, but so far. And then the other game, yeah, that was great. He's right. so starting at a seven, he's one to leader, so, but then plus three, so, or yeah. minus three. Uh, yeah. I know it was, yeah. It's I know the opposite of how it works at everything, right. Right? everything else. <laughs> um, and so five. <laughs> wow. We can safely assume that this scenario is going to be over. That's probably not. All right, ready. mop me up. Yeah. yeah well, I mean, at this bad. point, I might as well fire the rate, right? Yes. Uh, so Mr. that's surrender. It's gonna be on the seven because the bar gunner can fire. So it'll be on the six plus one. That's nothing. 
You're up. Those guys are finished. We got your leader. I mean, he's yeah, not going I anywhere. Know. Gotta save this guy. I that know. one firepower. Right. All right, this dude here <laughs> is going to assault well, to move. Tony, in our game, Tony ran the, uh, the leader into a building. And I was like, oh, man, this is going to get this is gonna get complicated. And I remembered the, the only two SPs can take back. Oh, right, <laughs> yeah. Points, I was like, Whoosh, that's important. <laughs> and then I'm going to take the turret off because it's going to align the front again. And we will fire the bow machine. We will fire both machine guns. Come. So four plus three. That's going to be nothing. Main armament at the building. Uh, I need a seven, five, two. I should have made one more hex. Oh, well. I missed. Okay. You're breaking up a little bit, but I oh, sorry. Do it, so. Yeah, bow machine gun. Yeah, Yo, you're good. Blah, 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 right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right. So this guy is going to have an assault move. I'm going to take the turret off because he's going to end up turning and aligning the turret. One, two, three, and he will fire his machine guns. I'm going to go ahead and mark the MA as well. Uh, so eight up three. I'm sorry, four up three. Mm -hmm. No. MA missed. Uh, actually, uh, yes, missed because I'm. No, still, almost, yeah. Yeah, real still close. no. So that was it. Assault. I'm not gonna roll. As you say, unless you're going to move your leader. <laughs> not going anywhere. <laughs> right. Yeah. So we'll go there. Actually, I wonder if I even need to do that. Does it make any difference? Yeah, because it'll help. It'll it'll affect your morale roll. So I think we'll do that. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't. Ah. Got it. Yeah. Now I can win. Yeah, exactly. Let me make it easy for you. Okay. Well, <laughs> if those guys make them morale checks, if they stay broken, I, I can't capture buildings. <laughs> right. Um, All right, that's you. All right. Yeah, I mean, I don't so think you're going to do anything with your leader, so I'm assuming end turn. No, no, no. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm just roll these guys All out. Right. Uh, so we'll this... do the, the guy with the casualty. So he's a seven. Tank's going to stop. Hey, he can Plus one for the leader, eight, and then minus two. So he's a six. Courage. I mean, I a lot of tens of morale check. Right. And then the other guy is a, should be one more. Uh, should be an eight. Does he go to surrender Third, on a rally? Or is that only when they first break? I don't think so. I don't think it, I think I'm not surrendered for non-rally uh, morale yeah, check. Yeah, I don't remember. But I could be wrong. Don't worry about it. I mean, just keep going. I mean, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter too much, right? I mean, <laughs> you're not, at this point, you're not, you're not concerned, right? Yeah, I, I think this. Yeah, well, simply that, remains that guy, broke. Other guy's yeah. gonna be a uh, seven. Ha! <laughs> and he missed it. Oh wow! Nice. Yeah, See, I mean, that's why I needed to get. Uh, a oh. Yes, it is exactly. Yeah, he would have made it if it hadn't been for those guys. Well, I mean, I think we can call it here because I don't. I don't yes. can't do anything on the last turn. No, and those guys are going to be toast because, you know, if I just move into melee, it's like, boom, done, right? So, <sighs> wow. Right. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I mean, I think the key to this scenario is well, two two things. Like you're saying, how do the Germans conduct their first couple moves? But then also on the other side, how do the Americans employ the tanks? Right. Right. So. Well, I mean, so honestly, I honestly, I think, I think the Americans have the advantage. I, I don't know what the plan is for the Germans because the Germans need to kill something. So if the the Americans run across the field, you put the guy in the hill and keep fourteen, and you with a machine gun, and you get some right. kills, and you're and you're set, and you have to keep a couple buildings. But right. that's it's so hard to 
you know, make, make you lose a unit when you've got, you know, two full squads, the, the bar gunner and the, right. the leader. Uh, yeah, my thought and then was put this guy up here at the beginning, right? He can start here, take that building, and now he can see mm -hmm. the whole field with that machine gun. You know what I mean? So he can light right. up the Americans as they but move. It, and then the rest of the guys... Go, go behind the buildings. Well, oh, sure. Because he can see over the buildings because he's... Uh, well, no, there's still blind hexes. High enough to see Right, but right. it doesn't matter. He can reach out and touch the Americans in whatever, as long as it's not a blind hex building. Like if you move into this one, you can't see because L14 blocks it. But when you move into L14, mm -hmm. you can get shot. You know what I mean? Even though you're getting the cover. Right, right, right. Right, right. and then the rest, the rest of the guys are taking these buildings, and then just, they just got to hold on, right? And that's the tricky part. Put a guy here with the Panzer Shrek, because if you hold, yeah, Tony so, had. Tony had, Tony had the, pan, the guy in the Panzer Strike there in that hex, and I was like, "Oh my god, how am I going to advance?" Because I hadn't right. moved very far down the road, right? And I was, and then he moved it. I was like, "Okay, thank God." <laughs> I right. didn't see how I was going to be able to make any progress. But yeah, because you leave him there, as soon as a tank hits here, you just light him up with opportunity fire, right? So you're you're banking yeah. for my money. You're banking on holding this building, this building, this building, this building, this building, maybe, and maybe well, this building, right? Well, o six, O sixteen pretty tough because if you take 016 and then you got a guy it's hard to get him back, back right without taking a lot of op fire from the tanks right yeah so, i agree but yeah that's that's i think that's the only the only way now tony's idea wasn't bad if the americans are all clustered on this side and you had a squad up here right yeah, you just run his ass down this way where he can't be shot because there's you know you can't see across the hedges and now you're over here taking these buildings you know what i mean so but but that's that's a problem is because you can, when you can, because you can move the tanks up so. I mean, on turn two, you can already Correct. have a tank in. What was it, P fifteen? Yeah. So it's really hard to do that because then you just run around the hit, and then you can use a continuous movement if you need to on a turn. And, okay, yeah, yeah, they might get somewhere, but they're gonna. I think the tank will right. run them down. Yeah, it's it's a question of timing, I think. Yeah, but you know, hey, whatever. But like we saw, I mean, in the, in the tournament, we saw five, uh, four German wins to one American win. So, yeah. Yeah, I don't think that was a. I don't. No. Really, I wouldn't consider a lot of those. Uh, no, I. I, I mean, still not. That's I'd why like, I still don't know how to play the game. Yeah, so. I'd like to. I mean, I'd like to see this played over and over and over just to see. You know what yep. I mean? Like swap sides yep. and and try it again mm -hmm. or, or whatever. Just keep trying different different scenarios or different uh, tactics. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll try and sit down when I do a scenario analysis. I'll look at it again because yeah. I expect to. It's gonna to be tough to write an analysis. No, I don't know what to write for the German. Yeah. <laughs> but I would like. Uh, there's. I'm, have you looked at the uh, Canuck bayonets yet? Uh, only briefly. It, I think the it's. Next one. Yeah, I think it looks pretty interesting. Um, I have. I have my ideas. Yeah, but, yeah. You know. It looks. Yeah, it looks tough. Mm -hmm. I. So I, I sold it, and, and <laughs> makes me realize I'm like, like normal normal ATS is like the stuff I'm worst at. I'm, Used to like you know hedgehogs and, 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 and you know like <laughs> right. w weird crap like just like attacking normal mostly flat terrain. Not, I'm right. like, pretty clueless. Yeah, but well, I, but I, I tried to like, sneak up. <laughs> Go ahead. I was gonna say that's why you know I just tell people you get you gotta read the orchard. Oh, you picked it. Yeah, that orchard provides a blind hex. No, I know. So from the hill, so you can't I see know. them. You know, so. That's the thing, though. So I, so I did that. So I crept up, mm -hmm. and then I had my assault force there with the mortar and shooting at the hill. Yeah. Um, and and a part of it was just really horrible rolling. So like the Germans rolled, I think, four twos and a three in a row. On oh the wow. Rolls. And yeah, and the Canadians rolled like a guy from around right now. They rolled three tens. <laughs> so it's hard to tell how much it was just horrible. Right. But I mean, that can happen in a game. Like right. you want you want to base your strategy on that. Right. that. So. I've been racking my brain for other ways to, uh, to approach it to see if there's some buildings that can get some cover in or mm -hmm. something. But um, yeah, I think it's going to be one of those that the, the the Canadians can easily take a few of those buildings because they can run up the sides. Right? Well, they can start in two of them and then run up the sides, but it's going to get really hard to fire them over against the the heart of the defense, depending on how the Germans set up. So, yeah, I think that's 
well, unless people don't know how to set up the defense as the Germans, I think it'll be. I think we're going to see a lot of a lot of German wins. Maybe, maybe, maybe. just an incompetent attack. Yeah, but I think it's easier to defend probably in that one than. than yeah, I think so. I think so. probably. Yeah. So in that one, you may you may you pay, people may want to insist on bidding, right? I don't know what I bid. I don't know how much I bid though. Maybe yeah. I bid as the Germans, like a half half a squad. Right. <laughs> Because the Germans don't have a lot of stuff either, but right. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, and the thing is, it's five turns. You know, if you had seven or eight turns, you could try and get your your brands and your mortar and try and get something going. You got longer range with the uh, with the squads than most of the most of the Canadian squads have longer range than the than the German squad. So right, um, but there's no real time to just kind of sit and pot shot and then so you get some casualties and some breaks. <laughs> An attack you know. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah but, so yeah I'll, i'm i've been studying that scenario so i probably won't look too much at the uh, grabbing some houses but i definitely want to uh, try to figure out the way yeah the way with the germans how to handle it oh yeah it might uh, just be the panzer trek you're trying you're trying to get the tank correct because remember it's, it's, it's not about tank hunting even though it's called grabbing some houses it's really about Kill right. <laughs> you kill a Sherman, the game's over. Stuff. Period. Yep. <laughs> so, yep. I'm sorry. You have yep. to wreck the Sherman. You can't end kill it. You got to wreck it. You got to K kill it. <laughs> hey, if they bail out. Oh, that's true. Kill they bail, bail out. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, I was, so, I was just so shocked. I was so shocked when people were were taking those chances. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> running through houses. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't believe like, it. Like, oh, no way. You immobilize and bail out, it's over. Yeah. So, anyway. So, yeah, and it's a 12% chance. It's like, let's, let's roll a die. If I roll a one, then I just automatically lose, right. automatically lose the game. Whoops. <laughs> I mean, I can understand if it's if you needed to, like if you were losing for some reason and the Americans like, okay, right. I have to. You know, well, like that was a, to, that was a chance to win. pretty awful risk I took with my Sherman. It's, and you happen to miss, right? One one chance in a in, in ten, but you know you also took some hits on that. So how many Germans are going to be willing right. to take the hits? Now, if you hadn't had everybody stacked in there, I don't think you probably would have taken that shot. Honestly, if there was just one squad in there with the Panzer Shrek, but I don't know, maybe because it's because like we said, it's a game. It's I a think game winning move, right? Right. I think so. this game I would have because. You know, it was a seventy percent chance. I don't know it was because right. I was calculating the possibility of not, but it's like a you know, what is a sixty-three percent chance? I guess of getting, of get of hitting the tank and then getting a not getting at least a possible kick kill, which doesn't automatically right. win if you am killed. Right, right, whatever. but still, yeah, you know what I mean. It's cl close enough. Yeah, yeah, close enough. You're you're a lot closer than you yeah. were. I mean, if you do that and you have a couple of buildings, you know what I mean. Right. Yeah. 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 Exactly. So that's the that's thing too. I is so I think critical that, that base of stuff. And stuff right. Killed. I think I think the Germans need to take these three buildings back here, for sure. Right, and then build on that with either getting a couple more buildings and then hunting, trying to kill a tank. Right. Or or an infantry unit. Right. I mean, three yeah. one squad is three is, three is three VP. So okay. that and two buildings, you win. Well, so yeah. That, I mean. And yes, I, I think the problem is that, like I said, having those tanks advance down the road so quickly makes it right. It makes it so like you have to, be, you know. I, thought, I figured I was going to be able to just, you know, get to the middle of the map and then just work my way back, and I'd get R thirteen and S sixteen, you know, <laughs> in my right. good speed time. And then all of a sudden, there's a Sherman. <laughs> the Sherman's were on, on top of back, you, right? So. Right. Anyway, cool, dude. That was fun.